All right, Wills, Estates, all that fun stuff. And these guys are on the grow. They're on the move. Uh, Ted Mann is here with, right, uh, with us right now. Managing partner, Mann Lawyers, LLP. Hello, how are you? A pleasure to be here. Thank you, Dylan. I'm Good well. How about you? Uh, I'm great. Uh, I know that you guys have been pretty darn busy. So first of all, how long has Mann Lawyers been around for at this point? Uh, we've been around. I've been doing it since 1994. We became a partnership in 2003. So, but all together, about 23 years. 23 years. Yes. Well, congratulations. Thank um, you. So, so you guys are you you have a lot of stuff going on right now yeah so uh, we just moved uh, our office was in the Scott Street building and we've moved over to the Holland uh, Avenue building at Holland Cross at the okay. corner of Scott and Holland and the uh, many lawyers from the firm of Burke Robertson came to join us as well our move was in order to make room for uh, the Burke Robertson folks joining us so we've gone now we're, we're now 30 lawyers oh uh, and uh, it's very exciting we have brand new office space and everyone's loving their office and we have lots of light coming in for all of the staff and uh, and we're uh, and the, the Burke Robertson folks are uh, have a lot of years of experience experience and uh, are bringing that to bear and servicing our joint client base so hmm. it's very exciting so it's a pretty decent partnership yeah it's great yeah we, we actually one one of our main uh, purposes or one of our main mission statements is to make sure everybody that comes to work enjoys coming to work mm -hmm. uh, and so everybody comes in with that approach and uh, for a bunch of lawyers we all get along really well <laughs> <laughs> so you have like uh, casual Fridays and crazy hot days we have crazy happens. yes we have that we have casual Fridays <laughs> we have birthdays we have a day a month when we celebrate everyone's birthday in oh, that good. month we have quarterly potlucks we have social events for staff and for the lawyers so we have a great time so you are the fun uh, firm in town that's what I would like to think of us as being. <laughs> we're serious, though. I mean, yeah. we love oh, what we do, and we're passionate about what we do, and we uh, our focus uh, our focus is the client. Mm -hmm. And so, for us, it's all about getting to know our clients well in order to be able to give them the best advice and the best service possible. Okay. What does it mean to be a full service law firm? So we do everything from corporate and commercial law. Uh, to real estate, both residential and commercial real estate. We help people with family laws, so that's cohabitation agreements, separation, divorce, custody access, and all of those issues. Uh, we also do personal injury law, so somebody who's been hurt in a car accident or slip and fall, we can help them. Mm. Uh, and we do general commercial litigation, so pe people that have fights about commercial issues, property issues, we also do that as well. Wow, pretty serious stuff. We love it, actually. Yeah, yeah, and it's good because you're, you're obviously helping people that's why I do what I do yeah it's, I just love being able to help and so do the others in my firm I love your slogan as well good people great lawyers well for me it's all about we're not we as lawyers aren't better than anybody else we just have a specific set of skills mm -hmm. and 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 so for us we just want to get along and we want to be able to get to know the clients that we have so we can give them the best service that we can mm -hmm. and uh, I like to think of us as as being good people because we care about the people around us and then we do everything we can once we get to know them to give them the best service mm -hmm. possible well you're a real credit to the uh, to the career because I know sometimes lawyers can be sort of typecast or you know as uh, maybe Maybe they're just after your money or this or that, but I can tell just by meeting you that you are a good person. Well, thank you, Dylan. I appreciate <laughs> that. Well, that's a good sign. Thank yeah, you very it's a much. Very good sign. And you're also here to help us with a couple of things. So, wills and estates. Yeah, I. Uh, so a significant part of my practice is in doing estate planning for people, which generally speaking involves preparing a will and powers of attorney. The problem is people don't like to talk about death mm -hmm. and so they tend to avoid preparing wills and powers of attorney powers of attorney are a problem if something happens to you and you're not able to sign documents uh, and you have not appointed somebody else to be your power of attorney then your your doc your your money and your property is frozen until somebody can be appointed by the court mm. a power of attorney allows somebody else to step in to do those things for you without the necessity of a court application or anything of that nature. Mm. And uh, when you do a will, it makes sure that the people that you want to inherit your estate uh, actually do inherit your estate. Okay. So th th for me, what I say, people don't like to talk about death, but what I say, we're talking about living. I always say if, if you do your will, you're going to live a lot longer than when you don't because it's often that the people that haven't prepared their wills are the ones that die tragically young. Mm. Uh, and I think having a good estate plan is a part of living a good long 
long and healthy life. So how long how long is the process to, to put together a proper will? So we will meet with clients. Uh, my my uh, uh, my my staff will be in touch with the client before they come in to give them some information that it helps me that helps me in helping them. And when the client comes in with that information, they'll sit with me for probably an hour and a half. Uh, and that's usually two or three weeks after they've uh, spoken with my clerk. And then it will take us three to four weeks to uh, put the documents together. We send everything out by email to save paper, and yes. uh, our clients will respond back, either come back to see me or ask questions over the phone. Sometimes with more complicated estates, it can go on for several months as we go back and forth and sort out various property issues. What age should you be thinking about this? Uh, as soon as you are, I would suggest as soon as you are 18 and you have any kind of assets at all, even without assets, as I've mentioned, the ability for somebody else to sign on your behalf if you're not able to is extremely important. So the sooner the better. Absolutely, by the time you start to own property, you start, you have a job and you start having an RSP or other assets would be a very good time. Okay, good people, great lawyers. Man Lawyers LLP. That's right. Uh, more details, of course, manlawyers.com. Ted Mann, thank you very much for being here today. It's a pleasure. Thank you so much, Dylan. Thank you. Have a great day. Lights, Camera, Cure, uh, celebrating Ottawa's 2017. Well, more celebrations, of course, this big year of ours. We've got more details in this cool event coming up next.